Have you ever wondered what makes black ink black? It's not as simple as you might think. Black ink is actually a mixture of many different colors all blended together. It might look black to your eyes, but hidden inside are brilliant reds, blues, yellows and more. We just need a way to reveal them. Imagine taking all the colors of a rainbow and swirling them together. That's what's happening inside your black ink pen. Pretty cool, right? In the next section, we're going to learn a fun and easy way to separate these colors and see the hidden rainbow inside your pen. Get ready for some colorful science fun. We can use a technique called chromatography to separate the colors in black ink. Chromatography is like a color separating magic trick. All you need is some special paper called chromatography paper, a jar of water, and your black ink pen. First, draw a line near the bottom of your chromatography paper using your black ink pen. Then, carefully place the bottom of the paper in a jar with a little bit of water. Make sure the water level is below your ink line. Now, watch closely. As the water travels up the paper, it carries the ink with it. But something amazing happens. The different colors in the black ink don't all travel at the same speed. Some colors, like yellow, are lighter and move quickly up the paper. Other colors, like blue, are heavier and move more slowly. As the water rises, it separates the colors, creating a beautiful rainbow pattern on your paper. Water works great for separating the colors in black ink. But what about other inks? Try using a permanent marker on your chromatography paper. The water won't carry the ink upwards this time. That's because permanent marker ink is different from black ink. To separate the colors in permanent marker, we need a stronger liquid called a solvent. Alcohol works well for this. If you try this experiment at home with a grown-up, you can see how alcohol separates the colors in permanent marker ink. Chromatography isn't just a fun science experiment. It's a really important tool that scientists use every day. For example, scientists use chromatography to make sure our food and cosmetics are safe. Some brightly colored foods and sweets use dyes to make them look more appealing. Scientists use chromatography to check these dyes and ensure they are safe to eat. They also use it to check hair dyes, lipsticks, and other cosmetics to make sure they don't contain any harmful ingredients. So next time you see a rainbow, remember the amazing science of chromatography that's working hard to keep us safe and healthy.